Hello everybody, and welcome back to Let's Play the Elder Scrolls Arena. Last time, we went through the Ice Palace, or Ice Fortress, whatever it's called, to uh, get this tablet that this guy is looking for. I'm back here in Winterhold to give it to him so he can show us the location of the Labyrinthine, which I um, was reminded that it is actually also a dungeon in the Elder Scrolls V, so that's pretty cool. I don't think they're anything alike. But, um, well, you'll see the Labyrinthian soon enough. Also, off screen, I got myself a brand new artifact weapon, the Ebony Blade. Which is pretty awesome because it drains health from enemies and heals you. I was also trying to get a new piece of armor. I wanted to get the Lord's Mail. But the guy I was talking to, I was talking, trying to get him to bring it up for like 15 minutes. But he brought up every single other artifact except for that one. So that, I don't know what's going on. I might have to wait till later. Anyway, let's see what this guy has to say. I sure was successful. Alright. So, we now have the location of the Labyrinthian. So, there's uh, no reason to dally. Let's head straight there. I'm all ready. Let's go. Is it in the same location in the Elder Scrolls V as well, like on the map of Skyrim? Hmm. Oh, and Shalador, I think he's mentioned too. Well, without further ado, let us go in. Oh, we already have enemies waiting for us. Okay. Sounds good. But this is pretty interesting. I'm gonna go slowly so it doesn't disappear too fast. So, that's interesting. That gives us a little background. We'll see how that kind of fits in, in a little bit. Alright, so that door is locked. I actually think you're able to just get through if you use your uh, pass wall, but I don't, we don't want to do that, now do we? So, okay. We need to find the first key, and it says to go through door number one. So I'm assuming that this is door number one. Uh, it, it is, it's door number one on the right. Yeah, see? Ooh, nice. So let's see, I haven't gotten a new level in a while. Got five points. Um. Willpower. Maybe some more to endurance. Why not? And uh, one more to agility. Okay, I probably should have put more in agility, but oh well. Okay, so uh, the dungeon is pretty much separated into two areas, both on the first floor and the second floor. Yes, there are two floors to this. So pretty much we're going through the east part right now. And we'll find stairs that lead to the lower east part. And uh, you can't access the west part unless you go to the west in the top floor and go down those stairs. Yes, there are two sets of stairs. Yeah, I did a little bit more research. Don't want to get lost in this place. Oh, this isn't even the worst maze. 
good and crafty weapons. I think we can... I think I remember it. Is there a jump button? Oh, there is. I haven't had to use that yet. But yeah, you can jump and crawl in these tunnels. Okay. Yeah, that jump button will actually be necessary in a coming dungeon. Oh. And there are pitfalls as well. <laughs> yeah, these are the ashes of uh, fire dogs who tried to kill me, but I had the aureole shield, so they just killed themselves. Well, they did some damage, but uh, they'll be rehealed because I have the ebony blade. Oh, snap. I not jump in here? Hmm. That's odd. Okay. I guess I can't... I guess the ceiling's too low? I don't know. I guess just more exploration. Let's see where we're at right now. Hmm. Oh, there's the blue door right there. See, it always helps to look at the map. Am um, I heading in the right direction? Not quite, a little bit lower. Almost there. It can be hard to tell sometimes. At least these maps aren't as confusing as the next Elder Scrolls game. Oh my gosh, those are the worst maps ever. And I do plan on showing you at some point or another. But, oh man, oh man, oh man, oh man. You'll just have to see. Well, shoot, how do we get up in there? Have to find a way to go west and north. Yeah, you see my uh, health bar? It uh, increases every time I hit him. Yeah. Pretty awesome. Don't want to lose this thing. This should be the way. Oh, spiders everywhere, and I hate spiders. I guess they're not as bad now since I'm freaking tough, and I don't seem to be paralyzed as much as I was in uh, previous playthroughs of this game. Or a previous playthrough. Wow, really? Did I seriously come back to the beginning? Well, I should have the path. Okay. I now know where to go. It's actually very easy. Double, triple check. Alright. So, we'll go this way. We'll go this way. There we go. The Domain of Magris. That was the name of one of the brothers. So, here we are. I believe I know the general direction in which I want to go. Oh, you stand before the Halls of Magris. I certainly do. Just when I was talking about, hey, I'm not getting paralyzed as much. Well, luckily I do have. I might as well use this now, potion of free action. I might need to want to buy more of those. Or I should have already bought more of those with how many spiders are freaking in here. But I'm not going to worry too much about it. No siree, Bob. I haven't seen one of those guys in a while. Remember, we're still in the very beginning of the game, and I'm pretty much overpowered because I found the Agma and beat them, like, right away. And plus, I've been doing the artifact quests, and plus I've been, um, putting all my, uh, points into, you know, stuff that actually counts for my class. No, I don't want... Okay. So that helps. Have a little, uh, knowledge of the game. Yeah, this place can be a maze. Let's see, can I open that? 
Let's see if I can pilfer it. I can at least do the wrong button to pilfer it. There we go. <laughs> and I had almost nothing. Yay! Not much else in here. Yeah. Lots more dead ends, folks. Said, I'm thinking I want to go to the northeast. So I'm going to keep heading east. I'm at least north. Oh. Killed this guy. And uh, yeah, some monsters, they don't leave bodies behind, so you can't really search them. But yeah, those are the reasons, those kinds of monsters are the reasons why you want to uh, work on willpower. Alright, I'll get you. Come here. What are you even? I don't know, but you're dead. Well, you were probably already dead to begin with, but I made you deader. nearby. Yeah, these things can kind of heal themselves. I think they can come back to life, too, if you let them. Because from what I've seen. Alright, more eastward movement. Yes, let's go towards the lava. Great idea. Alright. Oh yeah, it looks like uh, it's too low for me to jump, so if we kind of get stuck, it could be bad. Be careful. Let's see, is there a place where I can climb up? Oh, it looks like here, I guess. Some ghostly enemy wants to kill me. There's actually a spell you can use to levitate, but I don't have any crystals or anything for that. Go. Where am I? I do want to get down here, but yeah, it can be hard to tell which are pits and which are upper level like crawl spaces because it's all the same color. So yeah, it can be confusing. It's like like some kind of labyrinth around here. Ah, here we go. Here we go. This might actually be a lot shorter than... Oh, jeez. That's where I want to be, I believe. Or maybe I need to go back. I should go back. I'm trying to remember, is it on this side? Or this side? Let's go around this way. I know I'm at least uh, coming up on where I need to be. Oh, there's a goblin trying to kill me, and uh, yeah, I need to go back. But I'll kill these guys first. <laughs> One hit kills! And they probably don't have anything I need. Alright, back here. Oh, hello! You guys are just gonna kill yourself if you do that, you know that, right? Yes, yeah. <laughs> <coughs> oh, jeez. Bless me. Oh, crap, I can't get back in there. Gosh dang it all the heck. Okay, how do I get back? I need to go north again. Okay, that's easy enough. Some out here. The 
east. I'm not sure if you're supposed to approach it from the east side of it or from the west side. The side. Well, either way, we got to take the dying. Die a horrible death. Okay. I heard spiders don't feel pain or any kind of insect or arachnid, which is which is too bad because I want these spiders to be in immense amounts of pain when I'm chopping them to pieces. Alright, let's try it here. Uh, this just seems to go around these, so... Okay, yeah, we definitely do want to approach it from that side. Now, can I move up? It's kind of hard sometimes to know whether you can go up, because you can't look up or down in this game. I just don't think you can, can you? Hmm. Plus, there's like no climb button. There's just you press forward on a certain place and you climb automatically. Gosh dang, I need to make my way to the upper level part, I think. So I need to go on the upper and then I'll end up here. Next game, climbing is actually a skill you have to learn. You have to actually uh, work up your climbing stat. So I'll go through here. Jump. Okay, come on. Oh, I can't jump. No? Okay. Crap. <laughs> and I'm back to here. Just a second, I'll speed through this. Okay, I, th I, I figured it out now. Yeah, that noise we're hearing, guess who that is? I am Brother Magnus, the shade of this hall. I wish this life has been beginning to end. Find me the answer, and the door shall I call for me. But once in your heart will I rend. More beautiful than the face of your god, yet more wicked than the demon's forked tongue. Dead men eat it all the time, blind men who eat it die slow. What is your answer, Brother? Now, if you uh, don't answer this correctly, well, the ghost of uh, Magris will escape from his cell and attack you. You can still kill him, but uh, you still have to answer this riddle. And he's a bit harder than the other ghosts we've had to face. But uh, we should know the answer to this one, of course. The answer is nothing. No, no, he make sure to do it. Spell it right. Yet after ages, I'm at last free. The cell next to me lies a reward, a diamond key. Yeah, you can kind of see his red eye right there. But don't worry, he won't escape. He can't escape the locked door. But, this door opens, and there's a key! Okay, get it. Sometimes it's hard to get it. Come on. You have to be close enough to get it, but far away enough so that it, your cursor doesn't change when you actually want to click on it. I tried to look. I know in uh, um, a dagger fall, the next game you can they had a controls to look up or down. I'm freaking. If I can get this key. I'm trying to. Uh, come on. Kinda stupid when the hardest thing in the game is picking up an object that's right in front of you. It's easier when it's on a ra there we go. Freaking A. It's easier when it's on a raised platform because then you can just do it right in front of you, but yeah. Anyway. We have the key, so I will meet you back upstairs, so back to this little green area. Alright, so I'm back up and we have the key. So onward to. Oh, uh, no, you die. Oh, oh you 
son of a... Onward to the next piece of the staff of... Uh, chaos. I was going to say the staff of Magnus, but that's uh, something different. Did I go the wrong way? Onward. There we go. So we know their story. Should be able to get through. Nice. Why is everything slow right now? Come on. Get up, paralyzed. Come on, dude. Come on, bro. Come on. There we go. Die. 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 There. Freaking spiders. Hate them so much. Alright, so. Yeah, guess what? We still have another key that is in the west part of the second floor. But what will we have to go through to get that one? Well, you just got to find out next time on Let's Play The Elder Scrolls Arena. Thank you for watching and have a good day.